you're from Chicago, you know what season this is. It's not spring, but rather construction season. Time to repave hundreds of miles of road. But tonight, CBS 2's Roseanne Tejas asks, is every neighborhood getting its fair share of attention? It's a bumpy ride in Chicago this time of year. Winter has left its scars and truck traffic has done its damage. But today, the city launched its repaving season, announcing 275 miles of roads will be resurfaced this year. Some residents are skeptical. They patch our neighborhood and then they tear up all the other neighborhoods and give them nice streets. They take care of the big streets, but not the small streets. And that's always a problem. Do you think they're on top of things? Not here in Inglewood. Inglewood, we, all the streets are tore up, the side streets and everything. The city released this map showing in green all streets repaved since 2011 and in red those that will get attention this year. Why do some people feel so left out? There are always going to be people left out. The funds and the resources are just not there. This transportation expert says that's not unique to Chicago. You have to select those locations that are in dire need. The city says main arterial routes are selected based on pavement condition surveys conducted by CDOT with a goal of spreading work all around the city and says residential streets are identified by aldermen. What's your assessment of the city's performance? I think they're doing the best they can, in my opinion. They're doing okay, but you know, they could do better. Now, I had a chance to speak with Alderman Tony Folks, who represents part of Inglewood. She said she thinks the city is doing a good job. You'll remember one of her constituents in my story complained. She wants him to know that Marquette between Ashland and Ryan and Ashland between 63rd and 71st is on the list for repairs this year. So you can find out whether the streets in your neighborhood are on that list by going to our website, cbschicago.com. Work here in the South Loop, done for today. Roseanne Teas, CBS 2 News. Rob? Okay, thank you, Roseanne.